What's going on everybody and welcome back to another episode of The Hunter Call of the Wild. I know it's been a few days since we hopped on. I think last time we were hunting down packs of wolves, great wolves. Um, and today we're checking out a new reserve that we have not been to yet. All new types of animals. And I think we're going to try to do some bow hunting today. Because I've used um, a lot of the other weapons, not all of them. But uh, haven't taken anything down with a bow. So I figured... We would try that today. We are actually in um, Patagonia, uh, and apparently they have fucking pumas. The first thing I heard when I spawned in was a puma uh, growling at me. We actually do have a skill point that we can use as well. Weather prediction, health, decrease your visibility. Ability. What else do we got? Connect the dots. Each time a track, a trail line is automatically drawn. Okay, trail direction is also... Okay, that seems nice. So, anyway, welcome back to Call of the Wild. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you'd like to see some more of this on the channel, be sure to show some serious love to the like button down there. Subscribe if you happen to be new here. And without further ado, let's hop into it. I'm hoping they have, like, I don't know, something that a, a bow can take down. What the fuck is that moving? Dog, I need... Two is my bow. Do I still have the shotgun? I... Oh my god, that was a fly, I think. I just really don't want to get attacked by a puma. Can I see what's in my inventory? Okay, so one is my 30 out 6 Alright. I got it, just in case... Something runs up on me, because I swear that shit was growling. Like, it was kind of a growl, but almost like a scream. I might be more afraid of the puma than the lions in the African safari. On God. Look at this place, though. Beautiful, huh? Mule deer, just now. People from the USA love to brag about how great their mule deer hunting is back home. Yeah. But after they see the deer at Parque Fernando, they are not bragging anymore. Work-class bags and does are so abundant here. If we don't hunt them, they'll overpopulate and starve the other animals who graze here. Because these boludos eat everything. I don't know if this actually attracts the mule deer, but, um, let's check. Lures, um, reindeer, fallow deer, lesser kudu, caribou, jimbot, black buck, okay. Mule deer, okay. So my bleak collar. I got that. I don't know which... Is that my 7 slot? Nope. What is it? My 5? Do I even have it out? Wait. That shit is not even in my... Put that up there. Put it in my 5 slot. Okay. There we go. That's giving me some Leighton Lake District vibes. I can't wait. Maybe next episode we go back to where it all started. In the Leighton Lake District. Is that a mule deer? Oh. That fool yelled at me. <laughs> like. Oh, shit. He's gone, huh? He really saw me. I don't know how close I gotta get with the... The bow. Look at that, dude. I saw him running. Easily could have took him down with the rifle, but... We're going to make it a little bit more challenging on ourselves today. And only go for those bow shots. Just really got to try to get some... Some cover. Or something. Let's just do this damn objective. I'm just going to run. I know I'm going to scare him off, but... It's all good. Let's get this outpost done. Oh, shit. That was him again? I hear like a pig or some shit to my left. I don't know what the... Mule deer, we'd probably be okay with the 243. Oh, there he went. I don't think he's going to come close to this. 
This is actually a great lookout spot, though. Fantastic. All right, I'm up here, lady. Boom. This place is my pride and joy, and you can see why. I name it for my husband, Fernando. May he rest in peace. Before he died, I made him a promise that this reserve, with all its abundance, would host the world's most elite hunters and feed the communities around it. Time to keep that promise. <laughs> That's me. I've been hunting here since my husband bought the place all the way back in 1979. Damn. You may have heard, I was a two-time back-to-back national champion in the 50-meter rifle. Three oh, positions. shit. Real shit? I know guns. I know game. And my park nourishes the biggest, most exquisite free-range tags you'll ever hunt. World records are set here. Some of them belong to me. If you're as good as I'm paying you to be, maybe you'll set some records yourself. But let's not cut this torta before it's baked. We've got a lodge to build, outpost to open, wilderness to explore. This, this and shit is... If you see anything strange along the way, come straight to me and me alone. Loyalty is very, very important to me. My park is a paradise, but sometimes the disloyal people who work here have mala leche. You know, tough luck. Did she just threaten yeah, my life? Time for esposas y jefas. Telenovelas are my only vice. Simona's going to find out the identity of her biological father. Is it Gaston or Facundo? It better be Facundo, que churro. Gaston and his lies can be trusted. No, no, no. Look at this dude. Now, that's one task finished. Two more to go. Like, there's no way I'm hitting a bow shot from that far, right? I probably gotta be within... Fuck, I don't know, 50 yards? I'm not even hitting a rifle shot from that far. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, this lady scares the shit out of me. What is she talking about? I swear she threatened my life a second ago. She better stop playing games. Okay. Anyway, we got 570 meters to our first objective, which is to claim an outpost here. I'm scaring away every last deer. If I could get that one to just come on back to me. Come on back to me. Alright, we're gonna head over here to the outpost. If I run up on a deer and we get close, we'll come back. I have an affinity oh, with humans. Shit. Not just hunting them. Puma tracks. I've raised them, rehabilitated them, protected them. I bet we have more pumas per kilometer in this reserve than anywhere else in the Americas. They Probably. have a simple philosophy, one which I have applied to my business dealings. Respect the puma, the puma respects you. But this respect the puma once, you get no second chance, bitte. Okay. I'm gonna fucking bow hunt a puma. <laughs> I don't care. I don't care. I'll kill the hell out of him. Or her. All pumas can die. Damn, if I could get out of the weeds, that thing is gonna hear me coming from a mile away. The fuck? Now I'm not even going towards the outpost. I was... I was tracking. Alright, back... Back on the objective. Everything you need should be there. Set up the place. Alright, arrived at the first outpost. I have not seen anything. I did get yelled at by a, a, a b black black deer? A buck deer? Something. Yeah, what it was called. What is that? Something. Oh, this is way nicer than all the other places I've been to. What? Look at this. This is the nicest outpost by far. Can I actually go inside? Quickly. The Maybe I like already. Che. Che. 
I think I can go inside here. Oh shit! You've Look at that. the ball this far down the field. Now score the final goal. Okay. Two seventy huntsman. The Whitlock Model eighty six. Oh, this is sick, dude. Look at this. Okay, upstairs leave some things to be desired. That's okay. Oh yeah, look. Bed area over here. This is big ass deck. This is my spot. Okay. That's fantastic. What did she say? What was my mission now? I don't even know. Um, harvest any animal except a puma. All right. Just got to find me a deer. I know where it was yelling at me at. Let me see if I can spot one. I haven't found a damn thing walking around this place. And I'm hangry. I'm real mad. Y'all remember when I used to be like a good influence on y'all? About eating better and, you know, just a diet rich in fiber and antioxidants and nutrient-dense foods. And I was eating in a slight caloric deficit, you know what I mean? Eating until, you know, I'm 80% full feeling good, working out, lean, big, muscular, strong. I don't do none of that shit no more. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. I'm almost 200 pounds. I feel bloated. My skin is all fucked up. I'm hangry. I'm trying to do better, and I just, I don't want to do it. I just want to eat Chick-fil-A. I want to eat Chipotle with double steak and give me the queso, and I want one of them tractor drinks with it, too. I don't give a fuck. Like, have y'all tasted Domino's recently? The shit ain't bad. I swear to God. It really ain't. Sushi? I'll eat all of it. Give it to me. I don't care. Are we in Mexican tonight? Give me the queso. Give me the guac. Give me the salsa. And all the tacos. If they got a lote, throw it on. Desserts? Don't get me started. I'm fucking it up. I'm fucking all of it up. But today, I stepped on the scale this morning. 198. <sighs> Not good for me. Heaviest I've ever been was actually earlier this year. It was like 204. And then I started dieting. I got down to 185. Now I slacked off again. 198. <sighs> I need to be like 178 for health and longevity. So I gotta lose like 20 pounds, so I've eaten... what I eat today? A cutie? Look at this. I ate one cutie, um, some fucking hummus with pretzels, and like this little kind bar. Little chocolate bullshit bar. Fuck that bar. I need some fried chicken with the sauce on it. I'm just real mad. Um, just looking, looking for an animal to hunt. Uh... Hopefully, I find something soon. Spotted me a mule deer. Oh, he might have spotted me too, though. I was calling his ass. Go on and bring it in, brother. I'm about to stick an arrow in your neck, boy. <laughs> this is going to be fun. No way I actually hit a good shot. And definitely not from this range. Come on in a little closer, brother. You don't... Don't act like you see me. Oh, shit. Oh, he's coming with it, huh? A little closer. Oh, where's he at? Oh, he's going back the other way. Where's he going? Was that him or that's a different one? Oh, shit. Just got yelled at. Is he walking up on me right now? I think I scared him off. We got a few of them. That's a buck, boy. <clears throat> Gotta bring him in closer. 
I gotta get him within like. Fuck, I don't know, bro. If that target practice is any indication, 50 meters. If not closer. This just. This ain't working. Oh. Why don't I just rifle his ass? <laughs> Bitch. Were you running? Oh, yeah, that did not make it very far. I didn't mean to disrespect the mule deer like that. But bow hunting's hard, man. I gotta just take him down. Just take him down. If I see the puma, I'll bow hunt that thing. Even though that's probably way more dangerous. Okay. We got us a deer, though. I wonder, did the rest of them skedaddle? Is it possible they come back? Not seeing much. It's okay. Let's go harvest this guy. This venison will feed our family for generations. Look at that. That will do. Mm. Our chef is a master. You'll gain a few kilos eating his food. One plate is never enough. That was a good shot. We have a saying here, the truth is in the Milanesa, which is to say, proof is in action. And so far, you are proving worthy of your reputation. Thanks. Bravo. Bravo. Now, head up to the lodge site. Mark on your hunter mate. Damn. Once the lodge is complete, we can officially open Parque Fernando to the hunters of the world. 800 meters away? I'm trying to get me a puma first. Did I just run up on a cemetery? What is this? My Fernando isn't buried here. He deserves better. A blessed monument at our estancia. Unfortunately, several of Fernando's uncles, brothers, and cousins have met their ends here in the park. Those careless boludos never appreciated nature like Fernando did. They caused me so much heartache after Fernando passed. But... The thing is, family is family, so I've generously dedicated this little plot to their memories. Not that anybody ever comes to visit them. It's kind of fucked up, but all right. Here we go. Finally, there's a... Oh, shit. An Axis deer. Huh. I haven't seen one of those yet. Think we could call that thing in close enough to... Get a little bow shot on it or something, baby? Oh. Nope. That thing is running. He's fucking out of there. Oh. That's a noise. Found it again. I don't think I hit it a single time. I mean, I only shot at it once, but... Okay, that thing is in my way, bro. Damn tree. Kill shot? Maybe not, because that thing is running. <clears throat> I don't see it, but I did see a bunch of deer over here as well. Whole pack of them. Yeah, look at them. Look at them running. Red deer. Wow, there's a ton of them. I bet I could get at least one of those with the bow. Alright, let's see. Did I get the heart shot? on this guy or nah I feel like I did is that blood oh that's a big blood splatter yeah we got something vital organ hit I think that shot was money definitely ran this way right somewhere yep See more blood. Oh, there we go. Went down right behind the tree. Leads us right into the red deer. I just want to see a puma. I'm going to be honest. I love hunting deer. Don't get me wrong. It's great. They're pretty dumb. Pretty easy to hunt. But these apex predators, the lions, the fucking bison, pumas, 
Those are more like it. I missed the heart by that much. Oh, shit. I can't believe it. I barely missed it. Okay. Still solid, though. Okay, is this red deer tracks? Axis deer trout him. Okay. I know there's a ton of red deer. Up here somewhere. 35 rifle score. Just gotta find where they went. I also discovered a need zone. Oh yeah, there we go. That's like a single mule deer. I could easily take it down right here with the rifle, but let's see if I can get closer and actually take it down with the bow. Problem is it only drinks for a certain amount of time. And like, in order for me to get close enough to it, to not scare it, I kind of need to crouch. I'm thinking maybe I can do this little maneuver where I kind of like stand up and walk, but then crouch back down real quick. Still there. We're gonna try to get within about 50 meters of this guy. And then I'm gonna pop him. Just gotta be very, very careful about how we approach. Is he still there? He's still there. Closing the distance. We're about 120 meters out. There's so much thick brush right here, that's the problem. But man, he's sitting sideways, broadside. Showing me that lung. There's actually the perfect amount of cover in between us and him to where I could get pretty close without Spooking him, I feel like. I just need him to not leave. Please still be there. Nope. 65 meters away. I'm really trying to get up to like that tree. If I could get up to that tree, I'm not missing that shot. Fact. Just gotta make sure I don't hit any branches here. He's still drinking. Oh, did I? Oh shit. Oh fuck. Warning call. He's not even downwind. I'm gonna just lay down. If I spent all that time... Getting close and then that just happened. I still hear his footsteps. He's still there. Or he was, unless that was him walking away. Dude! I blew it. <laughs> now I do still hear something. Oh my god. Hit the shot. Oh! I got him! I hit him! I, we put him down! <laughs> no way! Dude, I couldn't shoot laying down. I had to get up. I had to stand up. I had like a split second to hit that shot. Bruh. That was solid. Oh shit, something yelled at me. What is that? Access to your mating call. Well, not this one. This one is MIA. Look, I got like a tracker in that shit. Where did I 
Hit at. Oh, baby. Hit a little higher than I wanted to, but that's okay. Improper ammo for this animal, but but I'm bow hunting. I'll take that all day, baby. That was a solid shot. All right, let's just continue along the lakeside here and keep just taking them down. Look at that archery score. I'll take that all day. See if we can track that big group of red deer that was over here as well. I'm hoping once I come up on top of these rocks, I've actually got a clear line of sight for a while. That would help us a lot. I'm gonna look up where the where the puma is. Like I'm gonna try to bow hunt it, but more than likely we're just gonna have to Oh my god. Look at that. Uh, Look at the one with the, with the antlers. Rest zone discovered. 140 meters away. I think I just got to take down that one with the antlers with a gun. Straight up. I'll do the 243. Because that thing is mad looking. I just can't tell how to... Place myself for the kill shot. Oh, he's big. That's a big old deer right there. Okay, there's the shot. But, like, is that gonna be a kill? Should I shoot in the back of the neck or. Let me do this. Oh my god, is that another? Oh, look at that fucking thing. I went for the heart. Tell me I got him. Tell me I got him. Did that scare these? Oh, kind of. Dude. Honestly, the one we shot was bigger and badder than the other one, so... Oh, I hope that was a heart shot. That thing looked sick. I didn't even check to see if it was mythical or... Yo, what the fuck is he doing? <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, shit. He's upside down. I don't see that other one, but... I'm gonna try to... Take my time here, because they do... Oh. There's one. See if we can move in a little closer on this guy. So I should be able to take out a whole lot of these if we're careful about how we do it. Yeah, look, they're all going back to the rest zone. That's crazy. Wait, does that mean these guys are going to come back too? No chance. I think just those. They're moving back. Just trying to stay out of their sight line, but if they go all the way back, they're gonna be downwind for me, so they might spot me. Where's that blood at though? Oh he dropped his big ass. Wait. Oh I thought that was a deer. That's that's not a deer. Never mind. We probably still dropped him, but Oh, yeah. Wait, is that a... That's a big splatter. That's a vital organ. Oh, baby. Very fresh. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. I don't know where the rest of the deer went, but... Looks like he came running through here. If I hit him in the heart, he made it a lot further than I imagined he would. Damn, I hope that thing was legendary. It looked legendary. That thing looked sick. That's a trophy. We're putting that big son of a bitch in the lodge. Just trying not to 
run and scare the rest of them. Oh, sp oh what the fuck is that? Is that is that thing special? An albino? It looked special. I'm scaring the shit out of these deer. That thing looked sick. Where the hell is my deer, man? I'm not losing them. There's no way I'm losing them. Let me just... Oh! Is that him? That's not him. Damn, there they go. Look at that. 200 meters away? Um... Give me the, give me the 30 out six. I'm setting that fucking billy goat. Down. I had to, I had to. Is this mine? I gotta go back to the last blood spot. Okay. Blood very low, but he was running this way. Was that? Oh, here we go. Back on the... There we go. He's down. He was just a little bit closer. Then we'll go check that fucking albino thing. Oh my god! What? Look at this, what is he? Common? Difficulty was very hard though. Class 6 red deer. Proper ammo. Did I hit the heart? I missed that one just to the left. Taxer demise that motherfucker. Okay. He's cool. Alright, now let's go... Let's go check this albino. And then let's try to find a puma already. Bro, tell me how it's running this way. It's trotting. It's running this way. And then... All tracks just disappear not only from the one I was tracking but all it's oh there it is anyway I don't know how all the tracks disappear but there it is oh thank you that looks incredible here it is let's see is this something albino fur type oh shot it in the ass in the pelvis, um, minor, uh, difficulty, okay, I don't know, that seems cool, I'm spending all my money doing the taxidermy thing, but okay, we got an albino deer, last but not least, I want to find this puma, all right, so here we are, I have traveled almost four kilometers to the bottom of the map because this is where, um, apparently we should be able to find some pumas. Look at this though, I found this big pile of poop. It's a water buffalo, bro. There's an easy I didn't know. Hunting water buffalo that easy trip. That's a surprising trip. number of people miss. Water buffalo loves water. Oh. Uh -huh. If any guest ever asks you where to find them, Doesn't send them to the lakes and swamps. Water buffalo are vital for containing uncontrolled vegetation growth in the reserve, especially during wet seasons. And their meat? Fantastic. Our local beef is world class. But if you ask me, I still prefer buffalo. Shit. I found the pumas. No chance. Okay. We found them. That was easy. Let's see, is that something? There too? No. Okay. So that one that we were looking at was a... Uh, female. I could probably hit that shot. From 240 meters away. I think the proper... It's class 5, so I'm pretty sure that's 30-06 territory. I think we can get away with using... A more powerful rifle on this thing. So let's see if I can get a little bit closer. The puma is indeed an apex predator, so 
I'm not going to be able to get too close to it without it knowing. But that shot right there. Is that a pluma? I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, shit. Yeah, it definitely is. I just... I can't... Hit that shot while I'm standing. I don't know why I'm... Swaying what feels like so much more than... Normal. I just... I can't take that shot, man. I could go for the heart if I could hit it. Oh, I was about to pull the trigger. And if I crouch, then... I can't see it. Oh, fucking motherfucker. I think I'm just going to have to try to take this shot from like 200 meters, but at least I can lay down and see what the hell I'm shooting at. Where'd that damn thing go? Don't tell me I lost it. I'm gonna be pissed. Oh, nope, there it went. Okay, so let me come out just a little bit here. This is a makeable shot. I can make this shot. 200. Let's go after the one that's a bit closer. 197 meters? If I lay down and aim for the heart? I think I can do it. Y'all got faith in me? Oh, I got that shot. I got this shot. Question is, how do I get that heart? That's exactly where I wanted to hit. Oh! Rocked it. The other one didn't even move. I might get two. I don't know if I'm effective from this range, but I can try. Did I hit that shot? Oh! These Pumas don't know what's going on, bro. Look, the other one's just standing there. <laughs> Stupid ass. Oh, Mr. Dumb. Hold up, bro. I'm going to get him, too. <sighs> Bang. Go on and drop, then. Oh. <sighs> Got him. <laughs> I just took down three Pumas. What were they doing? Oh, they're out for the count. What about a water buffalo now? I don't think the 30 out 6 is gonna do much to a water buffalo. I don't think we probably need that, that 7mm for something of that size. Let's go check these shots though. I think I hit that last guy like literally three times. It's probably not the cleanest kill. Oh, the water buffalo went this way. Look, here's its poop. That thing is massive. Very old water buffalo poop. So we could do some some tracking on that. Let's hope there are not more pumas over here. It would not be a good thing for us. Pretty much out of close range weapons. I think we're good though. Okay. Puma number one. Look at all three of them. Dropped them. Dumbass. Look at that. Female, common, difficulty, minor. I don't think that's really a trophy. I'm being honest with you. I would like to have a Puma in the safari, but. or the lodge. But I just... Damn, shot his ass in the leg. Oh, that one got him. Her. Very easy. That's no good. 
Another female, common, very easy. Can't. Can't put that one up. But I definitely could find some, some water buffalo now. Would you look at that? I found me some water buffalo. Actually, those don't look as big as I thought they were going to be. I bet you I can get close enough to them over here on this shore. It looks like a rest zone for him. What the hell was that? Something barked at me. I don't know what it was. Water buffalo. Okay, so we do have... There's a male. I guess we want to go after the hard male. Probably be the coolest one to have, right? So that guy right there. I could hit that shot. Let's get into about... At least 250 meters. Luckily, he's laying down. I mean, I know I could pierce the lungs from here. I just, again, don't know if the 30 out 6 is the correct ammo for this big son of a bitch. What else do we got over here? There's a lot of them. Damn. Okay. How far away are we? 225? Let me try to get a little bit closer. Right up here on the edge. And that should be good enough. 190 meters away. That's our shot, baby. Go ahead. Pull out the 30 out 6. It was that one, right? Let me mark it because I don't want to shoot the wrong one. You? Yeah, it's you. Okay. Um. I mean, shit, I'm guessing like right in there somewhere? The lung? Bang. There he goes. Only time will tell. <clears throat> if that was a, a good shot or not. Now I could just wait for them to come back, shoot me a couple. But I think I'm... I'm good with that one. Look at them skedaddle. Look at them running up through the... Yeah, I don't think they're... Coming back. Okay, I'm gonna have to run my goofy ass all the way around this lake. And track down this water buffalo, dude. To... The need zone. Now the question is... Can I find... Where I actually... Shot him. Oh! I think I found it. And that looks like a pretty large blood splatter. Yeah. Yeah, vital organ hit. Okay. Let's track this baby down. I can't tell if that's him up here. No. I think that's his poop. What the fuck? Sticky keys. I don't want that. Get my game back. We're on him. Somewhere. There we go. He couldn't have gone far. I believe in the 30. Oh, there he is. He did not make it very far. Took down a water buffalo, bro. <laughs> Killing it. Let's see. Look at that. Damn. Common, 993 kilograms. Okay, so definitely the improper ammo. I think we needed uh, something a little bit, something a little bit bigger. There's its heart. We just took the left lung out. That thing is fucking beast mode. I don't really spend money on anything else, so I'm gonna get us a water buffalo to put in the lodge too. Can we actually, can we go to our lodge? Hell yeah, go to that lodge. Hold up, let me, let me put my animals in real quick. Apparently you can do a full, like those beds in the, in the lodge is where you can put a full animal instead of just the head. I'm gonna put my fucking puma in that. Fact. This is gonna be sick. Okay, so I'm thinking 
Shit. Investigate mode? Edit mode. Yeah, here we go. I'm thinking Puma. Puma where? Where do we want the Puma at? I'm thinking right here in front of the fireplace, bro. You don't have any trophies that are placeable here. Medium platform. And this list only includes trophies of that size or smaller. What the fuck? What can I put here? Red deer? Where the fuck is my... Oh, do I have to have the... Safari Lodge in order to put... No, that can't be right. Trophy manager? Where are my trophies at, bro? Uh... Trophy manager. Look at that. Water buffalo. Saved harvest. Oh, I didn't get any of the pumas, did I? I didn't taxidermy the puma. What about the water buffalo, though? I'm trying to put his ass. What, do I need a large one? Give me... Oh, that must be a large one. Oh, there we go. I can put my buffalo right there. Oh, shit. I got a whole ass buffalo in it. That's dope. That's dope. Right here in the front? What about a just... Just big ass red deer? Bang. Oh. That looks like a... Horror film for sure. Is that like blood on this thing? I don't know. This shit is terrifying. Imagine actually, I don't know if some of y'all, maybe you do. But if you have dead animal heads like on your wall, you're fucking weird. <laughs> Straight up, dude. I'm not gonna lie. I am not gonna lie. Look at it. It's like moving. Oh, man. That's cool, though. In the game, that's cool. If that was actually in my house, I'd be fucking freaking out. I'm pretty sure that deer is moving its head, too. I'm almost certain he's jiggling. So I think that's going to do it for this episode of The Hunter Call of the Wild. Y'all let me know um, what else you think we should do in the game. Because we've done, you know, pretty much all of the reserves that I've wanted to play. We've done night hunting. Um, you know, we did the lions. We found the pumas. Uh, we've tried a little bit of bow hunting today. Um, so I've tried a lot of the stuff that I really want to do in game. Let me know if there's, um, anything in particular, uh, besides just going back and hunting, you know, bigger and better game that you guys would, would like to see me do. So, uh, anyway, that's going to do it for this episode of the Hunter Call of the Wild. Thank you for tuning in and I will catch you right back here next time. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like if you didn't just refresh it and give it one more chance. And as always guys, I don't really have a